Welcome to MultiTeach. In this video, I'll demonstrate the Puzzles, Match It, and Gravitoy apps found in the elementary menu of Snowflake MultiTeach. First, we'll look at the Puzzles app. Tap on the Puzzles icon to open it. On this menu, we can choose from various categories of preloaded puzzles. Here are the animal puzzles. You can tap on the Go Back button to go back up one level in the category menu. Here are the sports category puzzles. Let's take a look at one of the puzzles under the Countries category. Here you can choose the level of difficulty for the game. In puzzles, the user needs to arrange the pieces together completely to get the big picture. At any point during the gameplay, you can choose the Help option from any of the corner menus to display the Help screen. Tap anywhere on the Help screen to dismiss it. Drag the pieces to the correct location in the puzzle. Students can collaborate to solve the puzzle together. Students receive feedback at the completion of the puzzle. Tap on the Back button on the side menu to go back to the menu screen. You can use the Go Back button on the center screen to access the Puzzle Category Choice screen or tap on the Close App button from the corner menu to close the app. We will now take a look at the Match It app. Tap on the Match It icon to open it. Select any of the preloaded themes to start the game. You are presented with a help screen at the start of the game. Tap anywhere to dismiss it. Tap on two tiles to reveal content and see if it matches. Match similar tiles to remove them from the grid. Match all of the tiles within a given number of tries to win the game. You can go back to the previous screen by using the back button on the corner menu. Here we'll select an easier version of the colors game with 10 tries instead of 25. At the end of a round, you are presented with options to either go back to the previous screen or to restart the game. Here is a demonstration of the Gravitoy app in Snowflake MultiTeach. Gravitoy is a physics application where you can play around with physics, create shapes, connect shapes using joints, and change the gravity settings. Simply create a shape by drawing it. When drawn, lines cross the shape will break and fall apart. All shapes will interact with each other like real objects. You can connect objects to each other using the Create Joint button in the corner menu. Press down on the Create Joint button and then drag your finger over the objects that should be connected. Tap on the Clear button in the corner menu to clear the stage. The gravity of the sandbox can be changed with the gravity widget. The arrow shows the direction of the gravity and the bar shows its strength. Change the gravity by pressing and dragging in different directions. The further away the finger, the stronger the gravitation. To exit the app, tap the Close App button from the corner menu. In this segment, I'll review how the Zones feature can combine apps and lessons to enhance the multi-teach experience. This example shows how multi-teach can be used as part of an instructional unit about career and job exploration. In the bottom left zone is a rounds lesson that matches items to people who work in various jobs. In the top left zone is a match it game with the jobs theme. To the right is a word search activity using the scramble lesson type. The puzzle app is in the lower right corner and provides a choice of puzzles related to different types of jobs. This setup is good for front of class interaction or for use in tabletop mode as a learning station. Each zone can be quickly activated to appear in full screen. In full screen mode, students can interact in pairs or small groups to explore what each app or lesson has to offer. Teachers can prepare the multi-teach layout ahead of class and anchor class discussion activities to content in sequential order. Use the zone icon in the side menu, then select Save Current to save the layout. Here's an example of how MultiTeach can support a geography instructional theme. The Puzzle app's geography round appears in the top left zone. The geography app's world option is in the top right. A YouTube video is in the lower left zone, and a related tags lesson is in the lower right zone. The content can be easily moved by using the side menu swap zone feature. This is useful when students are interacting on a vertical display 
or when they're using Multiteach as a learning station in tabletop mode. Each app or lesson in a zone can be opened in full screen to facilitate interactive class discussions in sequential order. Lessons related to the instructional theme can be put into list and accessed in order, extending the Multiteach learning experience. Related videos can be accessed from a zone in full screen. Teachers can plan ahead and bookmark YouTube videos for later use or on the fly. This has been an overview of the Puzzles, Matchit, and Gravitoy apps in the elementary menu of Snowflake Multiteach and a demonstration of how the apps and related lessons can be combined using the Zones feature to enhance the Multiteach learning experience. For more information, visit these links.